Is that what you're doing? Yep. So Go welcome ahead. to Rob Talks. Matthew Good. Matthew <laughs> <laughs> Talk. Let's talk. No listen to Mac. <laughs> coffee because we're up when no one's up it's 2 a.m. and if you're up well, I guess it, it is Friday I mean yeah. people are partying that's true while well, we're sitting Wow well I guess the topic at hand will actually you know explain why we're sitting alone in your house instead of being at a club bumping shit oh well, this topic it is Bumping. Somebody bumped. You. A lot, a lot of people were bumping uglies. That, that's the term for sex. Did you not know that? No. Thanks, Rob. It's old. It's it, old saying. It is. Anyways, so what are we going to talk about, Rob? Matthew Good? No. Wow, you just want to bang everything around a little bit? We're going to talk about Star Wars. You can't even tell about Star Wars. It's Star Wars, though, believe me. I have the same glasses. And I would have brought them. Is everything in 3D? Holy fuck, you know what that reminds me of? What? <laughs> it's virtual reality. There's an episode of Beavis and Butthead, and they're like, holy shit, it's in 3D, and fucking Butthead punches Beavis in the face. <laughs> it, it, was, it was a good episode. Beavis and Butthead was really good. But yes, we are talking about Max ridiculous, redonkulous theory of Star Wars, which... I don't subscribe to, so... Well, uh, ever since The Force Awakens came out, like, everybody's been having their own theories, so it's like, Darth Plagueis is Snoke, which I kind of like that Snoke? one. Snoke? See, so, no. I'm thinking of Felicity. Oh, <laughs> I'm there. thinking of fucking Arrow. <laughs> yeah, for the Snoke. Who, who the fuck was that? No, wait, the computer tech. Wait, are you talking about that guy that I thought was actually a giant? Yep. Th that that almost pissed me off until they actually made it into a hologram. Yeah. That was inches away from being the worst thing, and I would have walked out. <laughs> and I know Nick at least had the same feelings where it was like, holy fuck, they're about to ruin this and shit all over it with giant. You know, a 30 fucking thousand foot man. I, I actually think he's... A like, midget? He's midget. Yoda? Yeah, he's actually Yoda. It's and well, that will tie into the other theory. I'm going to be talking about a couple of theories today. Uh, and one of them is fucking crazy as shit. Oh, the other one's pretty crazy too. So, anyways... Uh, Leather-bound books. Yes. Ow and Ow Brown Cow. You're supposed to do that before you start. Ow and Ow Brown Cow? Yeah. Unique New York. A tongue twister. Uh, no, get, get your it's tongue okay. all ready. Lots of people do it. Uh, I, I, I sit here with you. I, I don't need to do it. Yeah, no, we just we just we get just ramble until, yeah, yeah. until it works. Exactly. Yeah, no, I, I'm keeping this in the video. Oh, I know. Yeah, okay. I'm so just making your videos entertaining and hard to get through. Well, you made mine so easy to get through that it's nice. <laughs> I can make it really hard for you. So, anyways, this is going to be theory number one, and. We're talking about Ray and most of them and her lineage. Wait. Ray. Like Raymond. Like everybody loves Raymond. I'm try I can't, I can't stop thinking of Stevie Wonder. <laughs> oh, I'm trying to think of the other guy. <laughs> oh my fuck, what's uh, his name? Uh Ray? It's Ray Charles, there we go. Yeah, 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 okay. Is that who we're talking about? No. His father? Who happens to be Luke Skywalker? That's what you think? Are you going to spoil 
have any spoilers? Well, yeah, I suppose. Okay. So, this is quite spoilers. a ways in to the video, but yeah. Uh, no, again, we'll, we'll have fine. that in. Okay. And if you ha if you don't know the spoilers, it's, it's kind of fucked, because that movie's been out for... Oh, a month? A month? Yeah, yeah, a month. And I mean, it's... It's all, I accidentally spoiled it for two people, well, one person, and another person had it spoiled for them. So, I mean, well, if I you've just, made it spoiler-free this far, congratulations. congratulations. Yeah. yeah, because I ran around my work at the bar. I went, like, out into the bar and yelled, Han Solo dies. Really? Yep. Do you know how many people were pissed off at me? See, I thought about doing that. I went on the 19th at the very first showing on the 19th. I don't know when they started the showings. It probably did like a man may on the 18th. Yeah. But when I walked out of there, I was just like, I should fucking scream Han Solo dies by the hands of his kid, Kylo Ren. <laughs> and then, ben Solo. And then you look on Facebook and people actually got the shit kicked out of him. Which is hilarious. Stuff like that. It's super funny. Now just imagine getting a beat down by a bunch of fucking mouth breathing fucking neck beards. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Thanks, but, bud. Well, what, are you going to beat somebody down? I, I no, no but I have a neck beard. Yeah, that's... Yeah, same neck beard. Anyways, Anyways, we know a guy that right, so... He thinks Ray is a Skywalker. No. Or... I have a theory, too. And I will, I will yeah, yeah, and feel free to share it. Well, well, but, okay, so what I want to see is a Kenobi Do you want to see Ray's kids? No. I can show you them. I yeah. yeah it, ways it, of the it, Force. Just, yeah. Lift up your shirt. I'll just I'll just I'll just draw them. <laughs> we'll just we'll just, we'll just <laughs> go find a poster. And I'll, just, I'll just draw crude boobies on her. <laughs> but I'll say she did a topless shot. And did she? Not in Star Wars. Well, I mean, in hope one of her not. previous movies, and it was all over a forum that I go on to, which. If you haven't listened to No One Up, you probably should, because then you know what form I'm talking about. I'll leave the link in the description. Anyways, so I want to see I want to see her be a Kenobi. Because you want to see Kenobi's wiener. Do you no. want to see his wiener? No, Rob, Look, come on. I think that actually wasn't train spotting. Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking awesome. Anyway, sorry. Anyways, I want to see, well, like, leaning up to it, like, the Force vision and how... Obi Wan was there. These are your first steps. Is the only proof. Like, are but talking, I are you talking like how like he come back as like a spirit, like how they did at the end of episode three, proper episode three, episode six, proper episode six, not Hayden Christensen. Well, they would have to bring back Hayden Christensen and Ian McGregor because everybody else is dead. No, so. you just superimpose Alec McInnes or whatever, and fucking. Yeah, uh, so Darth Vader. I don't know his. I don't know the actor's name, but well, I guess you could, and you just have the actors. You know throw, up, throw everybody for a fucking loop and piss so many people off? Is have um, who voiced Darth Vader? What's his name? Oh, <laughs> James Earl Jones. Have him appear. <laughs> people will be like, "Oh my god, another black person starring in it." <laughs> no, I'm not a kid. Yeah. It's Darth Vader. It's always been, and then and then Lucas can go back and throw him in there instead. <laughs> Take out fucking Hayden Christensen. And Do you know how pissed that would be? <laughs> That'd be super fun. Well, but it makes sense. Yeah, I suppose so. So anyways, I want to see her be a Kenobi. And uh, what I think, and everybody was complaining how much of a Mary Sue she was. And for people who don't know what a Mary Sue is, is essentially a character who has no flaws and is perfect in every single way. So, for an example, Rob here is a Mary Sue. You're welcome. I'm... Did you just say I'm imperfect? Yeah. <laughs> Rise of the Imperfects. No. <laughs> she, she wasn't, no. No, no, she, she had her flaws. Yeah, yeah, but people were... Did you hear her fucking voice? <laughs> Pitiful fucking American accent. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. Finn did pretty good. Yeah, no, he did really good. Because when I heard his voice, his, like, you know, in his interviews, I was like... Oh, you're British, bud. Yep. Well, everybody's British. Yeah, I know. Except Adam Driver. Who's that? Uh, Kylo Ren. No, he's just... You know, he's just whining. Here, here's a quick theory for you, and anybody out there who wants to expand upon it, do it. You're but, totally, like, interrupting mine. I know. 
Well, I, this is Rob Talks I, I, fucking, with Mac. I, I'm, I'm overthrowing this, but it's a quick one. It's really quick. Okay. With who acquired LucasArts? Disney. Who plays Kylo Ren? Adam Driver. No. They got a previous actor from a Disney film. What? Dumbo. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I actually really like Kylo Ren, and I think his acting was spot on. For a good... Oh, no, I mean, he was great. For a good baddie. For being on, like, a CW show prior. What was he on? Uh, something girls. Oh, something. Well, yeah, hey, something. you can't... You can't always say, you know, CW just has girl shows because, you know, Arrow's on there. Your favorite Flash is on there. Yeah. Anyways. Yeah, one's coming up. Oh, yeah, Legends of Tomorrow. No, that came out yesterday. No, the one with all of them. Yeah, Legends of Tomorrow. Oh, it sounded like you said, like, Legends of Korra, and I was like, nah. <laughs> Legends that's, of that's, Korra. That's, that's Avatar. No. So, anyways, um, be a Kenobi. My reasons are, like, well, my theory and evidence. What was Kenobi doing for 20 years on tattooing? I don't know. Probably. Nobody does. Yeah. Not yet. Yeah, Until poke, I cracked it open I'm gonna the other point, day. I'm going to poke holes in here. Oh, yeah, you're, you're going to be poking holes. I I'd like to think it's going to happen, but... It, what? So, Kenobi was bored uh, 20 years, and he trained... Who did he train? Well, in the oh, force. Himself. Okay. Yeah, he trained himself. Well, no, he could speak to Qui-Gon. Anyways. Oh, yeah, that was a thing, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, that's still a thing. But it wasn't a thing at that point, though. Well, not, not back in the original. No. Anyways, um, sand people. I want to see Kenobi start a family with a colony of sand people. And within that, they ended up with Ray, who's three quarters sand person, quarter Kenobi. And her parents are just sand people, and they were on Jakku with her, but she was the only normal-looking one. So everybody was like, ah, oh, leave the girl. We got sticks. What? Uh, oh. Yeah. So anyways, they, her family's still on Jakku. They haven't left. Like now? Yeah, like, like now. Friends. Yeah. They're just hiding out. They're sand people, of course. And you gotta think, like... how do like, you know that sand people are actually on Jakku? Well, we don't. But how... Like, I mean, they don't seem like they're that technologically advanced. No, but they could store away. Anyways. With that, like... Uh, she looks like a sand person when she's... Doing her scavenging. And going you know, through I really wish they would've chose a fucking better name for those characters. Just saying. I the fucking, sand people? I fucking hate that. Yeah, it's a little racist. Anyways, so uh, that would also explain. 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 <laughs> it yeah, would explain uh, the amount of strength she had, especially with fighting with Kylo Ren. And I think that'd be rad. But she has the force. Yeah, well, and, and that's, that's, that's the, the quarter strength, can strength, will, strength will come from there, too. Well, no, it's that, amplified. And, that, and do you see what the fuck she's doing? On she's Jakku. got a she's stick. Sca she's a scavenger. She's got a stick. Just, just imagine you like fucking lifting heavy. I don't know what the fucks. No, I feel like she's a wiggler, not a lifter. <laughs> she's fucking. <laughs> I'm a wiggler shimmy, sometimes. Shimmy, shimmy, Fuck shimmy. it. <laughs> Who wants to exert that much energy to move a fucking bookshelf? Not me. Leave everything inside of it and wiggle it. <laughs> and everything just comes out and it just causes a bunch of shit to happen that you don't need. That's true. So, your theory, and quick, is Ray is actually a offspring of... Sand people. And Obi-Wan Kenobi. Yep. Okay, so... Okay. So, everybody's pointing the blame... Well, pointing fingers at who her father is, right? No. Online. Yeah, okay. Anyways, uh, nobody gives a shit. In yeah, life. nobody. They probably already gives know. A shit. Yeah. And they're gonna be like, "We're so glad you found your father." Qui Gon. Kind of. 
That's where I'm going with this. Really? Just, just here we go. Qui-Gon froze his semen in a sperm bank. A galactic sperm bank. <laughs> Episode 8 will be the fucking Galactic Federation battling over sperm banks. <laughs> Abortion clinics. Or that. <laughs> it's a whole Catholic, Christian, atheist fight. <laughs> Turn it into a Matrix, why not? Matrix was heavily influenced by religion. Oh, yeah, you can see that. Anyways, so, um, her vision, you see three potential candidates. When she touches the really lightsaber. I would have fucking, oh, yeah. And, and you hear two voices, right? And the first one we talked about, Obi-Wan. Second one is Yoda, which we will be talking about. Dear God, she's not Yoda's kid. No, hear me out. What, what do you mean, hear me out? Hear me out. Just let me... His fucking frog penis jumped ahead of a couple centuries. Let me explain. Okay, so Yoda is supposed to be this all-powerful being. Right? No. Well, yeah, he's he was master of all the Jedi. But why did he die of a heart attack? Uh, or natural causes. I, I don't know. What a wimp. He was like a thousand years old. <sighs> Calm her down. A thousand years old? Anyways, so in the Calm expanding down. universe, <laughs> calm her down. In the expanding universe with Darth Plagueis, uh, he actually created Anakin Skywalker. Not a lot of people know that. Who but created? Darth Plagueis. He manipulated. Also, what you have to note is that the extended universe, if you don't know nothing about Star Wars, is obsolete. It's not there anymore. Well, there. Well, no. They're still releasing stuff, and that is actual canon. That, but, I mean, if you read any of the books, you know... Prior to... That, or you know, the Darth Plagueis thing. Yeah, that's... That, that's not canon anymore. Because... No. Reasons. Because We're not going to get into thing. that. Yeah, no, that would that, make it a yeah. way longer video. Anyways, so, Darth Plagueis, in the EU, and the amount of stuff they borrowed from the EU in Force Awakens... EU. EU. You expanded. Universe. Oh, I, I thought you were talking about the fucking European Union. I'm like, <laughs> that's in Star Wars. Sorry, it's fucking late. A lot of coffee. I'm doing good. We're having a party. Anyways, so Darth Plagueis manipulated all the midichlorians and created Anakin. He created life. So he's God. But yeah, but then Plagueis killed him in his sleep. Apparently. Plagueis killed who? No, Palpatine. Sorry. Okay, I was like, what? Plagueis killed Plagueis? Is yeah. Plagueis the guy with the tattoos on his head? No. What? <sighs> what? I think... Again... Darth Maul? No, 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 no. It's an extended universe thing, and it, um... I don't it's know, from I the... Really dug into it. KOTOR series. Oh, no, 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 that's, like, way before what I'm talking about. Okay. I'm talking about, like... Right Maybe. before Anakin was born, kind of thing? Yeah. Okay. So, like, right before episode one. George Lucas should have just made episode zero. Uh, no, 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 probably did. a sex ed video. <laughs> a futuristic sex ed video. This is how you mix midichlorians. <laughs> In a pot. In a pot. Stir the pot. Yeah, no, I don't think that's how it, it would work. Stir it, it the more, other way. You had to do it with your hands. Or, or it would just be, you know, lights off and you just hear a whole bunch of... <laughs> <laughs> and then you hear fucking Plagueis, oh, and then, and then Anakin is born, and everybody then knows about the birds in the hand. <laughs> so, anyways, <It's> me. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny because that was his mother's name. Yeah, that's yeah, why. That's why he said it. <laughs> anyways, so if. Yoda is supposed to, well, rival that power. You think that, like, they'd be like, oh, yeah, he's dead, but he's a force ghost, so he's born with the force, so he can control everything more crazily and better. So he created Rey. Who? Yoda. Yoda. It's an interesting theory. It's better than the reincarnation of Anakin Skywalker. See, the whole thing that I'd have to do with that, or I'd have to think about that, like, I'd have to see the timeline of how far it was from 
episode five to seven. Uh, you mean episode six? No. Episode seven, because that's when we're first introduced to Ray. No, so, episode six to seven, you said five to seven. Yeah. Oh, well, because Yoda dies, dies in, in five. five. He dies in five, right? No, he dies in six. Oh, yeah, because he goes back to the Dagobah. Yeah. Who watches Star Wars? No, not me. But I told you before, I don't watch. Star Wars is good, but it's not my go-to thing. Anyway, sorry. I like to see the timeline from, yeah, six to seven to see. Uh, 30 years. And then there's your, there's your theory breaker right there. No, because as a force goes, and not like immediately, it's not like he made her and was like, okay, bye-bye, Luke. I did. Done. But he did die yeah. because you see his Well, yeah, him. yeah, he did die, but he became one with the force and shows up as a force ghost. So then as, right. as the ghost, he's doing the... Ooh. Yeah, no, I, I already said that. He became one with the force, so force That's ghost, easy. and he became even more powerful. So what if it's just, just the reincarnation like, of Yoda? Oh, or that's it. That's actually a new or one. Or reincarnation of, you know... Anakin Skywalker, that's already been said. And no. people have explored that. No, I was, I was and it's say really some, fucked. Some female Twi'lek or something like that from Twi'lek, Twi'lek from Anakin's time. I think it's uh, Kid Fisto. That was, that was a guy. Yeah, so you can... I, I guess, yeah. You can be I'm reincarnated to different things. species and sex. Yeah, that is true. I'm I'm sorry. Anyway. I, I don't know how this works. Anyways, those are all my theories. The, and, I mean, it would be cool to see, you know, at least the Obi-Wan. Yeah. Or I'm assuming the, nice. Yoda, the Yoda one would be cool to see how they would make it work, but In it's all probably going to be a hell of a lot more simple. Yeah, We're she's not probably not going to be even the Skywalker. You know, you know how much that would piss me off and probably a shit ton of other people? We already have a Skywalker. Spoilers. So, oh. <laughs> he's not a Skywalker, he's a Wren. <laughs> no, he's a solo. No, okay. Skywalker. I have two theories, too. Okay. Well, well this will be my third one, actually, so I came up with more theories than you. What up? Yeah, but mine. So, my, my first theory with the Dumbo, second theory, like I said, I love Kylo Ren. The I'm character. totally cutting this out. Why? <laughs> Don't cut this out. <laughs> I'll kick you with a pee pee. P and P. You can edit that so it actually writes pee pee on there too. That'll take a lot of time. You might not want to do that. No. Go on. Um. Okay. So, Kylo Ren is Kylo Ren. Ray is Ray. But she's not actually Ray. She's Stimpy. <laughs> and Kylo Ren and Stimpy are gonna come in. And wreck the fucking day. <laughs> no. Uh, but the other one that we were talking about on the way to 7-Eleven is... Again, this is really fucking fucked up. And it totally wouldn't happen like this. Unless... J.J. Abrams is kind of weird. And he's a good director. But I don't think he's going to go in the direction of... Luke and Leia actually fucked. Well, the amount of times they made <laughs> out in the prequels... It, it, yeah, exactly. So you, you don't know... Maybe there was a little bit of, you know, even just a little insertion, and then it's like, what are you doing with your wiener and your sister? She's like, oh, she's my sister? And then, you know, it only takes one pump to get someone pregnant, kids. One pump. Even in water. Especially in water. Um, but they actually had a kid. You see, like, we talked about this, and it would be Makes really sense. fucked up. But it would make sense. It would make and sense. And they didn't want nobody to find out about, you know, Luke and Leia, you know, fan fictioning themselves into a father and daughter and sister and mother and oh, that could be fucked up. So what they did is they dropped her off in Jakku, like a bunch of, you know, probably backwards hillbillies would. <laughs> and just be like, fend for yourself. We'll be back in, you know, a couple of years or something maybe. And I don't remember how the scene played out when she had met Leia, but... They like, hugged each other like they knew each other. Yeah, like, 
obviously they probably know each other because I'm going to take a guess and say that she is Luke Skywalker's son, daughter. Holy Christ, but... I, I don't... Man. I talked about it. I, I think with that whole thing, it's... She was a part of the Jedi uh, Academy before Kyle Ren destroyed it. Mm. As like... A oh, lot. Yeah, like a child. And Luke saw her and was like, well, you know what? Uh, she's the only one I could possibly save. And I'm not going to say there's any survivors because, you know, Kylo Ren, blah, blah, blah. And then I'm going to drop her off and then go into hiding. So when she shows up and it's like, hey, Luke, you're a lightsaber. I don't know. I still think, I still think that she's going to be, she has to be, she has to be connected somehow. So, yeah, that's I unfortunate. Mean, and, well, it's not really unfortunate, but I mean that. That's a theory that, you know, somebody probably has come up with, and there is probably fan fiction, because, I mean, it's been, what, 40 years since, 40, 40 plus years since Luke and Leia first kissed? So there, yeah, there probably, probably is, you know, <laughs> a, a couple gigs, maybe terabytes of fan fiction of weird, weird horrid fan fiction, but... On the last note, I think uh, Ray and Poe Dameron are, are be a couple. Yep, and I'm totally okay with it. What if Poe is this? That was weird. So, anyway, anyways, back obviously again. a jump cut there, but uh, Poe and Finn are gay, and I like that theory. Are gay? Yeah, 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 yeah. Shake it, 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 shake it